Okay, <laughs> everyone, now you're going to hear from Ms. Evelyn. Good morning. My name is Dr. Evelyn Leviso, and I'm the executive director here at Carrie Steel Kids Home. We cannot thank you enough for coming out and sharing your love with the children and this wonderful, beloved organization. We have the honor of being one of the oldest child caring organizations in the nation. We're now celebrating our 127th year of continuous operation. So if you can imagine for the last 127 years, people such as you have gathered around the holiday season to make sure that this home thrives and it is just a beautiful place of love for young people who are on a journey. We were founded by a woman named Carrie Steele, who was a maid at the Georgia Terminal Railroad Station. She was an emancipated slave, and in the late 1800s, she found abandoned children in downtown Atlanta. She decided she would do something to care for these children and started caring for them in an abandoned boxcar. And we have kept that very basic mission of making sure that young people get the very best to move them forward. Some of you may have been a little bit surprised that you were expecting little children here. We have adopted our, adapted our program here at Carrie Still Pitts Home to care for mostly teenagers and young people aging out of foster care. We want to make sure that the young people in our home have a smooth transition into post-secondary education. So we are very proud that all of our young people graduate from high school and they go off to trade school, college, military, wherever their talents take them through. Take That's them right. through. Right. Right. That's right. In this bunch here, we have one of our college students who is home for her Christmas break. We ha I have to recognize one of our rising seniors who just won the Posse Scholarship, which is a full tuition scholarship. This has been a home for about 27,000 young people in the Atlanta area. And I just cannot tell you that we could not do it without you. We're very also are very proud to let you know that it's stable leadership here at Cary Still Pitts Home. You would imagine that if an 127-year-old agency, we would have had multitude of leadership here at Carrie Still Pitts. I'm only the fifth executive director. Wow. All of the executive directors have been here long term. Miss Alfreda knew Olivet Allison, who was the fourth director of the home and grew up in the home and by being in the home was able to go to Spelman College and then to Atlanta University and really held true that she wanted what she got from being in the home passed on and to move forward with all of the young people. So we are just delighted again to have you here and you can be rest assured that your contributions to the home and what we do truly is transformative in every way with the young people. Yeah. So God bless you. Merry Christmas to all of you and my hope and my prayer is that this will not be your last time here in back at Gary Still Pitts Home. Yeah. Thank you. Well, okay, everyone, what we're going to do, we're going to open up so we can have cookies and juice and water and things of that nature. And I'm just going to add just a little quick thing. I actually attended Hopper High School right over here, a Trojan. And a lot of the kids, a lot of the kids that I went to school with actually lived here at Carrie Steel Pitts. And they were cheerleaders with me and, and everything. And it, so it's really a privilege when you're giving back to your community. And, and Miss Evelyn, I, and I'm calling her Miss Evelyn, when I first started volunteering many, many years ago, she was act, she wasn't the executive at that time, so I am so proud of you that you are still here. And I'm in my twenty eighth year here, so that yes. model has yes. been that yes. <laughs> yes. the motto has been that you have to do years of service before the board will allow you to move forward. So yes. definitely twenty eight years of service here. Yeah, and it's been a beautiful journey. Congratulations. And Councilman yeah. Bond, thank you for yes. leading us with this effort. Thank you so much. Well, thank you. We want to thank everybody who volunteered today. Yes, absolutely.